Good day everyone. For today's video, we will discuss about divergent plate boundary. If you are new to this channel don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell for more video updates. This time, I want you to analyze the photographs of rift valleys and ocean ridges. What have you observed? All pictures show a fissure or crack between two land masses. This indicates that the plates are moving away from each other. If this event continues for millions of years, the distance between the land masses will be far greater than what is shown in the pictures. In this case the plates are forming divergent plate boundary. Most divergent boundaries are situated along underwater mountain ranges called oceanic ridges. As the plates separate new materials from the mantle, ooze up to fill the gap. These materials will slowly cool to produce new ocean floor. The spreading rate at these ridges may vary from 2 to 20 centimeters per year. Although a very slow process divergence of plates ensures a continuous supply of new materials from the mantle. The Mid-Atlantic Ocean Ridge is an example of spreading center which causes the divergence of the South American plate and the African plate. When a spreading center develops within a continent, the crust may break into several segments. The breaking leads to the formation of down-faulted valleys called rift valleys. It is also associated with the rising of hot materials from the mantle. The rift valley increases its length and depth as the spreading continues. At this point the valley develops into a linear sea, similar to the Red Sea today. These are the important concepts to remember in divergent plate boundary. 1. Divergent boundaries occur along spreading centers where plates are moving apart and new crust is created by magma pushing up from the mantle. 2. Effects that are found at a divergent boundary between oceanic plates include a submarine mountain range such as the Mid-Atlantic Ridge, volcanic activity in the form of fissure eruptions, shallow earthquake activity creation of new seafloor, and a widening ocean basin. 3. If a divergent boundary is between continental plates the effects are rift valley formation which will soon develop into linear sea, shallow earthquake activities, and numerous normal faults. That's all for today's video, thank you for watching. I hope you learn a lot from this video. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.